location at the Madison, Wisconsin Supercharger, I finally been able to test out Tesla Spy on a fuller battery pack and while supercharging. Unfortunately, 2A was out of service. The charge port of Doom unable to charge, but here's what I noticed about how the cars top off your battery pack. Right now, we're charging at 18 kilowatt hour, or excuse me, 18 kilowatt, why did I say kilowatt hour? Now, I've been watching this for a while, and let's switch to it, there we go, it should be easier to read. Uh, as you can see, the highest voltage cells hover around 4.2 volts, plus or minus 4.2001. There's plus or minus 0 0.001. What I am noticing in comparison of what speed the char car is reporting, it is capping the voltage for the highest voltage brick of cells at 4.2 volts. And it is adjusting the charging current to reflect that. So only when a brick of cells hits 4.2 does it start to reduce charging current. Right now we're now at 17 kilowatt charge rate. And the reason I'm standing outside is because Vinny's going crazy inside playing. He's in a happy-go-lucky mood. And as you can see the highest brick of cells is still 4.2 volts. Now it's 4.201 volts. And at the same time the car is now the car is now reducing current to 16. And when we reflect back, it is standing at 4.2, and then it also flickered down back down to there we go. See, it dropped. So that is what is happening. The car is trying to keep the largest brick of cells at 4.2 volts or less, and that's why it drops the current. And it will keep dropping the current. That's why that last that last little bit takes so long at a supercharger is it drops the current to keep that highest brick of cells at or below 4.2 while allowing the lowest brick of cells to continue to charge. So while it is still charging, it's also trying to bleed off as much power from that those highest voltage brick of cells as it can. You can see how balance my battery pack is. It's impressive after supercharging. Uh, the balance of my pack is all the cells are within 9 millivolts of each other. And just something else that's interesting. Let's flip over to the next screen. This is the temperature of my pack after going from 30 miles up to 267 miles. So very low to almost full. 96% to almost full. The highest brick of cells is at 108.5 degrees Fahrenheit with the lowest at 104. Now every pretty much every document that I've read on consumer grade cells shows 113 as the happy place cutoff. Uh, once you get above 113 is when you start getting that that accelerated degradation. So I hope you oh dead battery. <laughs> now it's time for me to attempt to supercharge my phone. Um, now eventually I will get what the uh, the temperatures are uh, well, the car is charging at full blast with the uh, cooling system running. Uh, however, um, this has a distance of low power Bluetooth. That is it. More to come. Smile, cheese.